I think it might be better to thin out the group behind it, but yeah, it won't make any difference. It's the same either way. Yeah, he's going to take out one either way. It's not like he's going to do much else. And that's if he oh, hits yes. it, did he? Yes, Blop. he actually yep. hit it. Wow. All right, and he gets to go up a point, take Walker off. Is it 59 we're now he's down at to? 12. <coughs> need to really be churning out a little bit more points there, Ned. But we do have stuff in the car now. Good. All right. Okay, your people. Right. Um... How many move? How many actions has Rick got? He's got four, hasn't he? One action, one to die. So yes, so he's got four actions. Mm -hmm. Did I use two? I was going to say I'll search just to see if I can find something that would help towards us, but it's going to matter there, is it? Okay. Okay. Um. Gonna step into the. I was gonna say I'm sitting there going, "Oh my God, I'd forgotten the guy with the chainsaw isn't even in the zone." List. <laughs> I was just wondering whether or not I could lead them all a dance, you know, and, and sort of like back around the building to the other side. Um, okay, so I've stepped into there. Now he's got a chainsaw. Mm -hmm. He gets five dice. He gets plus one to dice roll. Therefore, he hits on a four or over, and he gets a free melee action with it. Mm -hmm. So, I want four or over to kill something, and this is his free melee action. Yep. One, two, three things are beheaded. Yep. So you got both of those out of our way. All right. Good. He gets two. Yeah. Take those two off. I've taken them off the count. Okay. And suddenly our square looks a little bit more livable at the moment. Trouble is everything's going to be activating now. Um, so he's still got three actions left because that was a free melee. So... He's going to use one to load up the rice into the car. Okay. Um. He can melee from inside the car. Is this correct? Yeah. Uh. Yeah. You can melee or or shoot. Yeah. You can combat from a car just like you were standing outside. But we can only fit four people in the car. Right. I'm going to recommend then that he's the one that doesn't get in the car. Okay. Because if anything happens and worse comes to worse than he's in amongst it all, he's the one with the very high melee. So can deal with big groups. Oh. Um. Or at least have a chance of dealing with big groups. Because anybody else, they've got like, you know, like, Josh, you'd have to swap to his chainsaw, or yeah. you've got a crowbar. Right. Josh does have slippery, though. Well, yes. He does have slippery, so he can move through zones of, of zombies as if they weren't really there. But, of course, he'd have to have free spaces to move to. Yes. Yeah, that's a point. So. Um. Yeah, that's a point. Um, okay then. I was just confused with even more. I don't know what to do then. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's just like, oh shit. Uh, like when I'm sitting the there with my guys going, which order do they go first? And do I need to count on Phil killing the ones in our thing? And it's like, oh my god. Let me move Josh off the car so we know that he's not actually in it at the All moment. Right. Yeah, when they get in, we'll stack them here on the bag of rice. All right, okay then. Um, I 
or actually what I'd, I think what we did last time is scrap a police car yeah and put it right there that's a good idea um okay uh well i don't know whether i should get in it and drive or not then because i'm going to be going first next turn aren't i but i want him to have his malee for when we get into mugs the group mm -hmm. although we're a bit wish rude when we get in one of there because they'll just move into our square and I'm down. Uh, okay, all right. Well, let's let's do it. Let's do it. He's getting in. He's going to drive. Okay. Driver's seat. Oh yes, there's four people in a car, isn't there? There's four <laughs> circles there for them. Right. Oh, I never noticed the little circles on there. Cool. Yeah. Um, Josh. All right. So, and he's got what? One movement left. One action left. Yeah. Boom. All righty. I mean, I could move the car. Can I move the car forward one? Is it, would that help us in any way? Uh... Probably not, would it? Because they move and then activate, move. And theoretically, I mean, according to the rules of moving cars, you'd have to roll against everybody in the zone as you moved out. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah. Yep. Wow, we're that bad a driver out with it. We'd run over all our friends when there's not even any zombies there. Well, <laughs> it's <really>. because <laughs> you keep trying to drive on the left side of the road. Quite possibly. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you keep getting in. Look where you put. Look where you put them. You got in on the right side of the car. This is America, damn it! <laughs> you got in on the right side of the car, and you're driving down the left side of the road. Of course, you run over everybody. They thought they were stepping out of your way. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> not my fault. You guys have got your cars and roads backwards. <laughs> uh, all right then. Right. So Josh, what can, he can really shoot, but um, has he got anything he needs to put into the car? Yes, he has a can of food. food. So yeah. I'll put that in. So that's what that's in there anyway. Alrighty. So we've now got everything in the car. Oh no, there's one more thing to go in yet, is there? Um, Amy's yeah, got I think water. Amy's got the water. Trust her not to put it in. No, I'm holding on to my water. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so right, so he's put that in. So he's now got three action points left. She just paranoid. She's like, I saw what y'all did with Wanda, leaving her behind. I know as long as I've got this water, you're not going to leave me. He's going to step back into there. Now, okay. does the abomination cover the wall? Because the wall is no, covered the abomination. No, he just, he, all he covers, all fatties and abominations cover runners. Right, in that case, I'm going to try and kill off those the, those walkers because they'll probably activate. Okay, okay. So he gets the, gets the plus one die ranged. So that gives him four die. Gets the plus one to dice roll. So he needs a three or over. Come on, Josh. Yeah. Right. yeah. Three or over. Yeah. Three kills three of them. Well done. Yeah. Yeah, that's... Yep. Yep. I'll take those off the count. One, Steps two, back into the room, three. into the one with the car. So we just leave one in there. Puts him up to 37. Two, three. Okay, there's your three. Okie dokie. That's his turn. Okay. Right, so I take the First player token. Now we have the fateful thing of all the zombies spawning. Get more than 16 zombies, we're screwed. Well, they actually walk first. Yeah. Yeah. Right, yeah. Yeah. Let's not let's not spawn them and then move them in on us. All right. Abomination moves up. Walker moves up. All oh, these guys move up. Yeah. <sighs> 
fatties move up. All of these move up. Suddenly that department store is even worse to be in than department stores usually are. Okay, all the shooting and killing and noise was over there, so I think that's right. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, they still go toward the building right now. Let's go two, let's go two. How many runners have we got on the board? Four. Four. Two of them have moved. The two in this group need to move again. To move forward. Mm -hmm. And then these all move out. Okay. All right. Okay. Now spawn time. Damn. This square here that's already overrun. Four oh, runners. Four runners. Speaking of running. Okay, that takes us up to eight. Unfortunately, that's good. We can have up to 28 runners for some god unknown reason. <laughs> <sighs> god. I think it's your fault, List, for not just buying a dozen more expansion packs. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness me, I can't even fit them in. <laughs> Let me move my dice to fit them in. Yeah. Oh, wow. This is an ugly street here. It really is. Next right. up. Five, five walkers. walkers. All right. I had those to count. So we do okay as long as we keep the numbers knocked down. That's the secret to that. It's definitely the secret. It's just like playing uh, um, a virus pandemic. Game. Thank you. Yeah, pandemic. pandemic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking. The virus game. It's just like mm -hmm. playing that. Got to keep those numbers knocked down. All right. Let's see what happens down here. The room has got four fatties. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We well just done. had four fatties in that room. What the hell is going on in that room? Oh, man. Well, we can't have four fatties. All we can have is three. Really? Yeah. Have we, have we hit the limit for fatties? We're hitting the limit of fatties there. So it's going to be they get an activation. Go oh, ahead. Bang, and... Did you take the one off when we killed it? I, for, I forgot to take, take yeah, the one I off. Yeah, I did. I think. Let's, let's count how many are on the board before we before we... I have to switch to our brown trousers. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yep, there's eleven. So yeah. Three here puts it to fourteen. That goes to fourteen. Um, and we had. We got a spawn of four, so yeah, so we can only go up to fourteen. So that's yeah, we do have to add in the two other walkers, though. So it'll still be eight walkers with it. All oh, right, okay. So that takes a sixty-seven. I would think because the walkers, the the fatties come with the walkers, and just I don't know what do you what do you think? This would be a judgment call. If you don't put the fatty on the board, do you have to put the walkers on the board? Um, well, my my first reaction would be no, because it's the it's the fatty that spawns in the walkers, isn't it? And if you can't spawn the fatty, you can't spawn the walkers. But sounds good to me. We'll take that, two off. Sounds good to me. I like your reasoning. I like the way you think, Batman. <laughs> all right, so they're all in that nasty. Well, the walkers are being yeah, they'll, they'll be in that. I'll nasty, put the walkers in because these are gonna these are gonna they're they all gonna to move. activate, don't they? Yeah. All right. One's in the building first. These two move up. Okay. This one moves up. Now, which way do these fours go? I'm assuming this way. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. So they're all going to move up. Up. Oh. 
A cross. Yeah, <laughs> finding places to put them down. We need a bigger board. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Yeah. Right, right. Move these two runners back so we know which one they're actually on. All right, then these move up. Yeah, starting to jam pack them in here. Starting to look like festival seating. Standing room only. And so these are going to move out. Uh, those, those three are going to move up. Oh, yeah, I mean, those four the are three that up. you're put, the three yeah, you're putting they, in here, so they're going to move out. They're going to move out. So to just square, okay, so. just go ahead and put them in this one, since these four are moving up. All right, God. All right, nothing with fatties. Nothing with fatties. Last one. Four walkers. Four walkers. Wow. Oh my goodness, we're one away from a walker activation. <laughs> wow. Whew. We put right. those on the tally. I did. Yep. Okay, I'm afraid I'll have to take a quick bathroom break. Go I'll right ahead. I'll get some more coffee. Rose up on the car. <laughs>